Talk to us about the uh, uh, the challenges in the wealth management union. Is this da unit is this down to um, the problem of negative rates? Well, uh, first of all, I think we, we we have to acknowledge that in a in this uh, environment where. Uh, people are facing negative interest rates obviously their need for a professional investment solution is actually increasing and uh, i think our results are a great testimony to that as we have delivered 6.9 percent growth and especially also from our fixed income boutique where we deliver more uh, modern more sophisticated um, uh, investment solution that cater for the need of these clients that includes also 24 asset management our boutique uh, in London and also the sustainability side. Um, we just have seen, uh, I would say the whole industry has seen on the, when we go back more to the stricter part of wealth management, uh, slow transactional activity and the slower mm. development of business, we on top had to digest uh, the, the integration which is now uh, finished and done and wrapped up and uh, we for Fontobel remain confident that we will return to the four to six percent growth target in wealth management too. Okay, so that's the growth target. And, and are you able to recruit, good morning to you, Zeno, are you able to recruit uh, wealth management advisors as quickly as you want to? What is stopping that business from getting bigger more quickly? Yes, uh, first uh, we have deliberately stopped our hiring spree a little bit over the last one and a half year as we wanted to focus uh, on the integration work. This is uh, done. We're now back uh, to hiring. We see uh, an interesting flow of great quality people. We are one of the employers of choice. We will continue to hire great talent though. We see hiring relationship managers only as one source of organic growth. We are convinced that our investment-led proposition, uh, the quality of our products, the level of our services and of our advice the quality of our brand will generate organic growth also from within any you, you mentioned or you talk about organic growth and it's very popular but I wonder about your M&A plans do you have a strategy there in place is there anything you're pursuing I mean we have executed uh, on a very clearly laid out M&A strategy over the last four to five years we uh, bought skills and market access. We bought the skills in uh, sophisticated fixed income uh, management from 24 in London. We bought uh, quantitative asset management through Westcar. We bought us market access into Italy and we bought us scale uh, through the acquisition of Notenstein La Roche. A very well executed uh, M&A strategy. We now are in a position where we still have the capacity, we have the capital, we increased our uh, uh, CET1 ratio quite uh, remarkably in the last years to show an example, but obviously we have become more selective. We uh, will uh, continue to look, but uh, we are in a position of strengths. We don't have to do M&A if something comes along that fits our needs, that fits our criteria. We may well uh, execute, but our um, criteria have only sharpened. Okay, let me ask you about the strength you see at the moment, Zeno, then, because Credit Suisse, of course, facing some well-known, well-publicized, well-documented scandals that I know have been the talk of Zurich uh, to, to in, in some senses over recent months. Is that something that your business is able to benefit from? Are you seeing clients come to you because they don't want the distraction elsewhere? Uh, first, we, uh, uh, in contrary to you, we decline to comment on uh, competitors, obviously. Uh, second, we build our strategy on our strengths and not on uh, perceived weaknesses of our competitors. But you do want to offer safe and secure asset management, wealth management, uh, you know, if there are times of volatility in uh, other places around Switzerland, you must take advantage of that moment to pounce on those clients? Of course, what Fontobel offers and brings to the table is first and foremost its investment capacity, its advice, its service capacity, so the skills and the edge of our products and services. But 
What Fontobel brings to the table as well is we are rooted and anchored with a majority shareholder that brings a very long-term vision to the table. Uh, we have stability, we have a pedigree of, of integrity and of trust and we think that that combination is of interest to clients.